welcome back to my channel so but what the fuck bro bro what the fuck though it says so it's about to be a story time i know this angle isn't exactly cute but listen this is about to be the realest video or drive with me y'all ever watch so i don't need to get copyrighted like maybe it's just this music oh now you want to go back there really sir anyway um so basically i'm gonna be talking to you guys about the things i've basically learned in this business things i've understood come to understand and etc so basically some of the things i've come to understand is that in the business world industry you have no friend you have no friend one and secondly everything everyone is selfish at some point in time everybody's selfish now when i opened the salon i was exhausted when it was opening time i was very exhausted exhausted because i had gone through so much just to get it opened um when it finally opened like the first month or two i was going every single day obviously nurturing my little baby then i got to a point maybe at the three month mark where i started getting a little tired because i wasn't getting a break i wasn't getting leave i wasn't getting anything every single day was the same routine so i started slacking off a little bit meaning like relaxing taking a breather taking a break because i saw that it's working you know but it's still a baby three months is still an infant so i got to a point where i was appointing people and then there was people that we've been working with or i've been worked with before so my trust levels with them was kind of high which is probably not a good thing um just never trust nobody but my trust levels were quite good and i even appointed a manager for the salon um in case when i'm not there to ensure that everything is working spiff and span that customers are happy and all that stuff now let me tell you something even the ceo can be fired like even the what is it an asset president of a big ass company can be fired why because you do anything that goes against the code of conduct of the company listen boo boo you can be fired so what i've learned is that you need to be very careful with who you put in charge you need to be very careful whoever you put anywhere because anything at any point in time can go wrong you need to always be vigilant and you just always need to stay woke like i slept for a minute listen just one minute i slept and then just everything hit the fan everything hit the fan i had to be firing people because i could not believe the stuff that were happening listen everyone's a liar everyone is everyone steals like i understand what they say when they say you're guilty until proven innocent because literally every mother effa is guilty until proven otherwise um so i'm not slip anymore <laughs> i'm woke i'm going to work and i'm going to look after my baby like there's no way i am letting go of this baby anytime soon um and i'm not gonna allow this dip people are gonna make the thing you've worked so hard for dip and i'm not about that literally slay for one minute and like <laughs> it's like i was you why'd you sleep you was never supposed to sleep you was supposed to always stay woke um i've learned my lesson for sure but yeah i just wanted to like come on and have a drive with me with you guys and kind of tell you guys that listen anything you work hard for and anything you want success in or grow in you should actually never sleep like sleep is for the dead honestly sleep is for the dead i'm pretty sure people are billionaires they didn't start off by sleeping like i started off by sleeping ha <laughs> don't sleep that's one thing i know for sure for sure um another thing i've learned is yes you can trust 
actually i lied don't trust nobody all you need to do is give them the benefit of the doubt give them a benefit of the doubt but still put your security measures still check still do you know all of that because working on this trust policy system is just not gonna work um another thing is do regular checkups on everything i mean everything stock take camera check security stuff every single thing that you could put your hands on do it because that's money that you could have made but you didn't and just at most do your best in maximizing your profit your potential profit because that's potential profit right there that you were happy with the money you made the profit you made but listen your business could have actually been doing 60,000 times better but you just didn't do your checks like right now i'm talking to myself because i'm telling myself like this this is the advice i'm telling myself but yeah i've learned guys i've honestly learned um, hi guys so i just wanted to quickly come here and end the vlog like on a good note because i know it was a drive with me a rant type of thing uh, getting real with you guys but i do want to say having a business is obviously a blessing it's a good thing it's an amazing experience um i want to be very successful but at the same time i want to share with you guys when things just don't go great and when things are great you know the highs and lows i think you guys also do enjoy it when i just am real i feel like anybody enjoys when anybody else is real um sometimes do add in some fairy tale here and there but i definitely did want to share that rant I did in the morning with you guys so plus I don't feel like vlogging in the salon because I feel like it takes away the slightest professionalism with them um, I just feel like I need to be cutthroat and just be real and just kind of we here to work we're not exactly here to play games and I feel like in the beginning I was actually way too nice and they it kind of went on the wrong foot where to the point where it kind of crossed boundaries a bit so now i'm kind of just like i'm that woman i'm that lady that is just just come to work do your job i'll still see if i can still make it fun but like my fun is limiting af like it's like one percent from it being a hundred and ten percent it's like one percent fun um i'm just gonna be cordial with everybody it's because at the end of the day, this is the business. Anyway, let me stop rambling. Um, I hope you guys have an amazing festive season. I will still be vlogging. I'll still put up content for you guys. Do not worry about that. Plus, it's like very... It's like a calming thing. It's a calming thing to chat with you guys. Um, let me know in the comment section what you guys think about this type of video. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next one. It's kind of awkward because people are just staring and people are coming in. And yeah, so I'll end it chat. <laughs> Bye.